Uh, Aaron on the visuals. Black royalty. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to another excellent edition of the Puffer Podcast. I'm your host, as always, the Big Puffer. And I'm Big Lock. You know what we do. And today, we've really outdone ourselves because we have another packed house full with a lot of great people. A lot Today's of Today's going to be an awesome show, so great I hope day. you stay tuned for the whole thing, because if you don't, you're doing yourself a disservice. Um, yeah, first, well. before I even start, I want to give a big shout out to Pot.TV cannabis culture and my man Anil over here big on shout the out doing his thing no we do um but yeah we're gonna let uh, these guests uh, introduce themselves mm-hmm. um yeah just uh, what's starting up? i guess yeah starting yeah, you know who it is it's obi from nigeria representing vancouver hey straight up shout out that's what it is Shout out Lord Jeezy. You know Respect. Uh, Lord Geezy. <laughs> Lord <laughs> Geezy. <laughs> there we go. What up? I'm Cody Van Gogh. I'm a professional joint roller. Hey, <laughs> yo, show this shit off. Where that at? We'll, we'll, we'll get yeah. to it, but show okay. them a little taste. Show them Just a show them a taste, okay. taste okay. bro. I'll show so. Oh, yeah, that's... We got a Damn, nude one. Lots of shit up in here. Right now. Fuck you, man. Yeah. What the fuck? These are all oh, smokable. That. No, <laughs> that's just... That's just that's show yeah, he's a professional yeah, drawing yeah, role. We'll get more into know. that, but uh, we got we got too many guests up in here. No such Stupid. thing. Stupid, never. <laughs> I'm Young Roman, uh, mixer, master producer, and rapper. I represent G Town, 604 Block Star. G Town, G Town, oh. all the way. That's what I'm Hey! You already know it's Ace Boogie in, in the, the cut. cut. Yo, Ace you know Boogie. You, you might know Ace Boogie from behind the board sometimes <laughs> doing his thing low key, yeah, but for the, the first cut. time, Ace Boogie up right. here. Out for real, in the camera. field. You know? That's what it is. Showing and then also off camera here, we got my man Reaper Films, Canadian Underdogs, and Safar, who's going to be joining <laughs> us later <laughs> for another freestyle. I know y'all yep, enjoyed yep. that last week. 
Woo, That's stay tuned, stay tuned. That's what so how do. y'all doing, man? Oh, and we can't even forget J Mo just in the corner yeah, there. He always the, chill. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> yeah. How you do, How's everybody doing today? Y'all good? Chilling, man. Just chilling. Hey, that's yeah, what it yeah, we good, we good. Yeah. It's a blessed day, blessed day. That's got a lot up. of that's nice up. surprises for y'all today. So, oh yeah, we Lots, got a lot nice. in store. Some so actually, you know Santa Claus Claus came with a huge bag. Yeah. Actually, yeah, I yeah. did. I did want to kind of start off with with Cody because. Yeah, yeah, might as well. We already Hell you know, yeah. I mean, got everyone all like, "What a professional joint roller!" Dude, like, so what? Maybe, maybe kind of tell them exactly, you know, what, what it, it is, is you, you do, do, and then we'll maybe get into some of these dope little pieces you got here. Yeah, for sure. So I'm, uh, I'm Cody Van Gogh. You can see me on Instagram as Roll with Cody Van Gogh. I am a professional joint roller. Uh, for the last three years, I've been rolling. Um, various, mostly creative joints, and also I've got some production work like these nude blend pre rolls. You can get them at uh, Cannabis Culture and various hey, other Hey, out. go yeah. get those! Go get those! Straight up. Uh, paperless joints. Um, yeah, I do uh, most, mostly just anything to do with rolling. Um, is what I what I'll do. I've uh, I've had some pro- like high profile clients in the past. I rolled for like uh, Snoop Dogg, Machine Gun Kelly. Whoa! Uh, yeah. Whoa! <laughs> um, shit! Okay. Okay. So you've been around so, it. Yeah. Yeah. I've, I've I've been around for a little bit now. Um, I've done it in Toronto, uh, California. Now I'm more. Now I'm uh, more permanently in in Vancouver. So. There um, you go. There you Vancouver, go. Vancouver. Yeah. Vancouver thanks That's you. Oh, we thanks. do thank you. Oh, Vancouver's been been great for rolling. Like there's so much pot culture out here. Um right. and that's really like there's me and like maybe a dozen other people who do this and we're in the world. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> so so we comprise the National Joint League it's called, which is kind of like where we show off, we compete. You can follow us on Instagram, uh National Joint League on Instagram. NJL. Yeah. <laughs> That's hard. That's hard. Yeah. So I'm I'm the uh the Canadian arm of that. <laughs> oh, you represent yeah. for the Maple you know Leaf what putting saying? on. Yeah. <laughs> for real. But uh well, one thing that you notice is like um rollers the uh, like we all tend to come from legal states and states where there, there's a lot more mm-hmm. like culture behind mm-hmm. it mm-hmm. you know where places where like a lot of people have heady glass collections or like you know you have a lot of different options for like uh, different canvas products like beyond just the bud you can get your bath bombs or your whatever <laughs> um, for sure yeah so and it's like it's places like that where where you tend to start seeing more and more creative rollers so I don't think I'll be the last in Canada I know a few people are like uh, aspiring to it right now and getting really good at it um, but yeah it's a uh, I'm, I seriously I'm kind hope of pioneering you, this. I seriously hope you you inspire more people to Hell actually. Hell yeah! Because oh, I've thanks. seen Push, some of bring your, those numbers. I've up. seen some yeah. of the stuff you've rolled. You rolled that that gnome at four twenty. That was a crazy. Pound of yeah, a yeah. Huge. A like, one yo, a, one pound gnome joint. <laughs> oh a one pound God. gnome joint. And you said it lit for like an hour and a half. Yeah, yeah, an hour and a half, two hours. I was Ooh. I was blitzed by the end of it. So I I bet, yeah. Oh, <laughs> um, oh man. But yeah, we lit we lit it up at four twenty, and it was sometime after six when I when we put out like um, like I, I would say the Tip last the like <laughs> yeah. the last like three <laughs> ounces or so were so like resin cast and roach that it was like a three ounce roach. Right? Um, I was gonna say. Yeah. yeah. We <laughs> where's uh, you roach? Call that a roach? <laughs> 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 we, we left that in an alley for like just some people to find or whatever you left it um, in the alley yeah <laughs> it was like uh anyone would think to smoke the t- tip of a nomad but that's the, cool that's cool the other 21 or whatever ounces right. were we, we we smoked me and the cannabis culture staff a few of them uh at 420 and uh, yeah, it was a lot of fun. Um, so it was actually like it, it's weird that a a lot, a lot of people just know me as that gnome guy now because really? I had a lot of pictures taken. Right, um, yeah. I probably should have wrote my name on it or something. <laughs> how many? I don't know. You know, how many rollies did it take you to roll that thing? Um, it was at least two five me- meter rolls of a uh, raw for the base, and then probably like. I would say altogether roughly like another 10 meters of juicy to to cover it 10 meters of rolling papers yeah yeah plus you buy them five you meters. buy them by the roll for a project like that uh, <gasps> oh my and god the thing is um it's weird like a lot of people are uh are really like like attached to that like the big projects and that kind of thing um and it's weird to say that it's, it's actually a little bit 
easier than uh, a, a lot of the, like the small stuff. Like it, it's it's weird what like um, the mass audiences appreciate compared to like what the the rollers and the people in the NJL appreciate. And um, sure. uh, so like that that was uh, using a technique which is called molding, which is I, I actually took a garden gnome. Uh, and I paper mache it with with the rolling paper and using acacia, which is like the same stuff that they use on on rolling glue. Oh, wow. um, whereas another, the other like popular method is is freehand rolling, and I've done some like massive rolls like that. Um, but then more recently, like micro rolls have been kind of kind of my thing because they yeah, yeah. Like that. <laughs> they just yeah, so what is they're so a lot that. more challenging. Like he's under three grams without the uh, without the glass filter. Wow. And I forget what Where would you light that? Uh, so you'd light it at the wings and on the head, like at the tips of the wings. Yeah, it's just like a cross joint. Like the actual like bulk of the wings is just paper, so that'll just burn off and stop when it hits the joint. Um, much like if you've ever seen like a reverse roll or something like that. Um, so yeah, uh, he'll burn fine. He's, he's got air passages going through him uh, for airflow, things like that. Um, it's a little unicorn. Uh, this guy's actually under two grams. <laughs> Ooh, that's yeah. like fire, uh, yo. Yeah. How'd you light that one? Uh, this one, you just light them at the horn and then and the nose, and then as it started to burn down, you could light the feet, um, but you want them to kind of burn evenly. You don't want to light the back feet first because you'll just be sucking all the air from there. Uh -huh. uh, yeah, so there there are methods to to smoking them. Uh, you get better at it. That's <laughs> um, so cool. I've smoked cool. a lot of creative rolls now, how, so how long you been give doing so this much for? Advice on it. Three years. Three years. Three years. Yeah. Uh, it's <laughs> and and why don't you tell the people a little bit how you like decided you like you're going all into the joint roll and you're telling me a bit about that. Oh yeah. Um, it was. Uh, I, I've got so many ways of telling this story. Because <laughs> <laughs> no, um, so. yeah, it was it was kind of like a lot of a lot of factors adding up at once. Um, uh, I was like I was working at a restaurant and uh, just like washing dishes, and uh, <laughs> I didn't really like it. I had a good job before that, but I moved back to like be closer to my niece. Uh, my I, I had got a new niece, and so yeah, yeah. moved back closer to home so I could watch her grow up and stuff. Um, but just couldn't find a decent job. And then uh, one day I rolled a cross joint with like a little tulip on top and um, it kind of looked like a person. So uh, I added like a dress with juicy papers, like give it some color and like a little bun. And it eventually ended up looking like one of the servers at my work. So I gave it to her what? and then it was just like, the the response to that like not just from her but from everybody was was so good um, that like uh, I just pushed it as far as I could took every request or like challenge that I could um, and eventually learned how to do it better and better um, I was always like rolling like cross joints and tulips and things like that before I got into like creative rolling um, but yeah it just it was kind of a happy accident. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no, that's really that's dope, so dude. Cool, man. That's dope. So what's the I guess what's what's next? What's the next yeah. challenge or what's the next thing you're you're trying to roll? Yeah, let's oh, here. Um there's so many ideas and uh <laughs> Right now, I'd like to catch up with production on Nude Blunts, honestly, because there's more, there's more, um, it's it's really just me doing it, and there's a lot more demand than there is supply. Um, so, like, I'd like to get, like, be able to train some people on how to do, how to do Nude Blunts. Um, Hell yeah. Those yeah. smoke nice, too, you know what I mean? They don't canoe. That's what, that's for sure. No, right? no, they, they burn perfectly. Like, this was, this was my daily driver for, um, a long time, like, and then, uh, once I brought it, cause I, I was doing this in California, um, but I was kind of discovered it, uh, with a friend of mine from the league, Gene the Goon. We were Ooh, just kind of, shout out to Gene the Goon. Goon. Shout out yeah. to that name, um, too. Fire name, that's a fire name, bro. That's a fire name, bro. Gene the Goon. <laughs> That's hard. That's Shout hard. out. So yeah, yeah. Follow him on Instagram too. He's part of National Joint League, and we were up in a cabin in the woods in Humboldt, like just uh -huh. off, completely off the grid, and rolling tie sticks every day so that we didn't have to like keep rolling joints. Tie sticks burn for so long. Um, so we we would roll these tie sticks, and then eventually we started to like run out of things like shatter and uh, the like leaves and like the stuff that we needed to roll tie sticks. Yeah. So we were left with just bud, and we eventually figured out a way to do it. What? Um, that became my daily driver, and I started to like refine it. And when I 
got back to um, I came back to Vancouver after that before going back to Toronto again. But when I came back to Vancouver, I started like you know rolling them up for personals and then sharing them with people who then immediately wanted more of them. Um, uh -huh. So yeah, it just kind of it kind of grew into like a little a little business for me, um, and it's it, it's really helped with like supporting like the the creative rolling side of things too. Um, it's just kind of so. become my bread and butter when I can do whatever I want if I don't have like commission rolling to do. Um, sure. Yo, yeah. that's what's up, that's man. So that's so up, sick, bro. bro. This, this smokes long too, bro. It does, it does. It smokes yeah. very long. But this, yeah. this is actually a mini one. The average time on like a, a three gram like retail nude blunt is uh, of like about 40 minutes. So. Damn. 40 minutes. That's crazy. Well, man, thank you for sharing thank these you, awesome. Bro, that's oh, like, thanks you know? for having me. Yo, if you guys want to check out you. his stuff, can you hit, hit, hit his uh, so they can see his Yeah, name. roll yeah. with Cody Van Gogh. You can also follow at Nude Blunts. Um, I can't believe I got that account name, but it's just Nude Blunts. Like, you don't even Yo, put it on the screen. Just type in Nude Blunts. Oh, um, geez, the that's original. What's up. Yeah. We'll and definitely have to have you back here again, you know, when you... Yeah, oh, for sure. That's for awesome. Sure. Thank you very much. Thank that's you. Dope. That's so sick, man. I can't wait to see what else you come up with. <laughs> straight up. Straight up. <laughs> yeah, so like, I still can't get over the gnome, yo. That thing was Dude, fire, Dude, like, yo. what? Don't you even think of that? A fucking gnome, bro. Like, <laughs> you're looking in the garden. And you're <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. I'm going to smoke one of those. Like, you know? <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, you know, we have... We have like a lot of guests here today. A Today's lot. show is gonna be so dope. Like so it's already dope. been dope, and it's yeah. just gonna continue to be dope. But next, I wanted to get to my man over here, Obi. Obi. Uh, I kind of wanted you, you know to just maybe let let people kind of know who you are, what it is you do, and then maybe we kind of will, and then maybe kind of describe or give a little uh, insight on this video that okay. we'll play, and then we'll play the video, and we'll come back, and then we'll kind of you know talk to you a little bit more, you know? All right, for sure, for sure. So, uh, Into the mic, please, my friend. <laughs> mic check. One, two. You That's good. It. There you go. There, yeah, you go. there we go. <laughs> All right. So who is OBI? OBI is, uh, is a vibe. Is okay. an artist. You know what I mean? I step into the room and people recognize and they realize that this is not just an artist or a human being or someone who influences through not only his music and his style and what he says, the way he speaks, you know what I mean? So mm -hmm. that is OBI. Okay. Word. And what I do, I'm a music artist. Not, I won't say a hip hop artist because we both know like hip hop's changed over the mm -hmm. years. There's, <laughs> I mean, there's, <laughs> yeah, I won't say trash, changed. shitty, but I mean, there's just like, it's definitely changed. People yeah. who think they can do hip hop, you know what I mean? There are a lot of talents out there. I'm mm -hmm. not gonna lie, especially here in Vancouver. Straight up. I mean, like it's. I've, I I thought it was only black people that could do this hip hop thing, but <laughs> I've been seeing a lot. You know what I mean? I've been seeing a lot of colors. Yeah. Black shit, man. Like the other day, All I saw colors. this uh, Asian chick. She was so fucking good, man. Yeah. Hey, I'm not, I don't want to battle her, man. <laughs> you, know? <laughs> you know what yeah. I mean? So I mean, like, what's, what's her shame, name? Yeah, bro. don't battle her. Bring her on the show, <laughs> brother. We need to yeah. we need to meet this chick. <laughs> now. I'm just playing but anyways um yeah what i do is just um, i'm a hip-hop artist i'm a music artist i'm a music influence you know what i mean that's that's what i do i feel you i feel yeah. you okay okay so yeah why don't you tell us about this put it to the side video we played it here last week but we're gonna play it again you know wanna give us like a little background about how this video All came right, to sure, sure, and for and sure. for before you, what does obi stand for well uh <laughs> funny story OBI is actually the last three letters of my last name, my real name. Okay. Which is Onwa Bobi. I'm from Nigeria, so. Hey, West Africa represent. You know what it is. Come on. Onwa Bobi. So OBI means the meaning of Onwa Bobi is the mouth is not the heart. Mm. Oh. That's some deep shit. That is so some deep shit. I took OBI, which is the heart, meaning I'm the heart of music. Hey. Okay. Oh, okay. Exactly. So. Shit. That's who OBI is, and what he does is be in the heart of music all hey. his life, from whenever he started his career till the end, till the end, till the legacy is built, till the name is remembered. I Shit, like that. I like that. Shit, brother, damn, Shit. you had that rehearsed or something? Yo, for real, bro. It's like chills up my spine. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty. 
Shit, yeah. well, tell yeah. us about this video, brother. That's yeah, right. let us know. Yeah, put it to the side. Yeah, it's, everyone's um, probably wondering, like, damn, we want to see this video <laughs> now, yo. Honestly, honestly, okay. How how this shit started was uh, I wanted to release a five track EP called Methodic Cooking. At at start with this really dope producer I met, Poritsky. Uh, I met him through another friend, an artist too. Uh, what's his name? Easy. It's pretty good. Check shout out. On. Yeah, shout out Easy. And um, yeah, I was gonna do five tracks, release that shit. That was before I uh, I met House Records. Shout out House Records. Shout out, shout uh, out. And uh, we became a team. You know what I mean. And since then we've been building. I got this album coming out called Black and White. Hey, <laughs> when's that coming? So out? The, 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 it's it's, it's coming. coming. Pretty it's soon, coming. Pretty soon. <laughs> okay. we're, st- we're still in the kitchen. <laughs> okay, there you go. Yeah, there you yeah. go. You know, it's one step at a time. You know, there's no rush. Mm, in the I end, feel right? you. You gotta, you gotta release the finished product. You don't want to mm. release, you know, mm-hmm. something you're not sure. You're not sure. sure. So, anyways, um, I was gonna do methodic cooking. I'm still gonna do that. I was gonna release methodic cooking at first, before the album, but things changed. I'm gonna release the album, and I, uh, I, I had to move some of the songs from methodic cooking. So. I changed the concept of the album to half track trap and half track just you know miscellaneous I would say right that's the word like different vibe different kind vibes, of you know different flow, different stuff, flow. Yeah. they're just playing around you know like trying Not to all reach one the style. different you know what yeah, I mean yeah, I feel like you. I still keep that you know new day because I love that trap shit man I'm not gonna lie you know like I, I enjoy writing to trap shit I mm. like that's that's dope man yeah. I'm not gonna lie, like all these new new artists who are actually doing it, they're doing it good. Shout out to them. They're, Shout you know, out. Yeah. And then the OGs, Migos, who've actually, you know, started this shit and influenced a lot of people. You know what I mean? So, yeah, that's just what the album's going to be, black and white. How and it's put it album. put it on the side going to be on that album? Put it to the side is on the album. Okay, well, put let's, let's get into that, yo. Let's put it to the it side, to Obi. Let's, let's get check it here. Still hard, yo. Know? Uh, <laughs> We're singing it last week, singing it this was, week. Let's so fire. Let's fire, yo. Let's put it to the side, uh, Obi. Okay, get that's, that, a, that's a fire run video, yo. Shot by, you know, respect, Reaper respect. Films, who's in, in the, the cut right now. Shout doing out Reaper. Thing. Shout out Reaper Films, who really, you know, fucked that up in a good way, you know? For real, so, for real. So, yeah, you know what I mean? We're, we're going to, we'll, we'll get to some more conversations with Obi in a bit, but we, we, we got to, you know, we got to keep it moving. We got so we many got fire so guests many, in the yeah. building, you know? So, I want to get into the homie, Young Roman here. Why don't you tell everybody who you are and kind of what you do? 
Mike check. Mike check one two. All right, there we go. Yeah. Uh, basically, what I do is I'm a mixing master producer. I've been doing it since I was like around 15 years old. I'm a rapper too. Uh, for style wise, I mean, there's so many different styles out there right now. You know, I'm just trying to experiment with every single sound that I got right now. And, uh, a yeah. real block star. Block star. Yeah, yeah, that's, <laughs> right? that's it. The, the block, I see that. I the see block that. star movement. It's just right? like, I don't know. Like uh, It's just like, I, I'm a star on the block. We're all stars on the block because we're from G, like, G Town, wherever you're from, you're the star on the block. You know, you're making music. That's <laughs> I what I want to be. I want to be a block star. Hey, you I know what I mean? That. That's, that's, that's hard. what I mean by that. Yeah. Also, I see you, you got that little, like, I don't want to say rock star vibe, but you know, I, sometimes you got that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah like, trappy rap, rock star. Yeah, shit, I, you know? like, you know, like, I'm still with it and everything. Like I'm just trying to mix. I like to. I don't know. I want to be who I am. I don't want to be. Everybody should be who they are. They shouldn't be someone else they aren't. They shouldn't be, like, worried about whatever everybody's gonna say about them. Just be yourself. Like that's that's who I am. That's trying to tell to the artists, the young ones. You know, just be yourself. Like, you know, like I got like. Most people don't know. I'm not full white. I'm half. Indonesian half white. I found white. this out today. I was yeah, like, shit. Right, right. I did so not like, know this guy was not yeah. half white. Shit. Okay. Half Indonesian. That's half crazy. Indonesian, half white, right? So, like, I mean, you know, it's just, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just, like, I want to put that out there because everyone's commenting and stuff like, oh, generic white rapper. But it's like, I'm trying something different, you know? Mixing yeah. rock. Like, I got Asian influence, too. Like, I like... Like Asians, like they're going crazy right now for like rap work down down there. And the beats, man, some of those are wavy, right? If you mix them together for a different style, maybe you can get something, right? You know, yeah, like just like songs. I'm trying to make a new. I heard hip hop's big over in like Japan and stuff right? like that. Yeah, yeah yo, it's, it's wild down there, man. It's wild. Heard that. Yeah. That's All right, sick, so uh, that's how did you sick. how did you how did you even get into music, and how long have you been doing music for? All right, so it was my fifth birthday, and uh, I woke up to. Uh, an iPod Nano right beside my uh, desk, right? Wait, I, how old are you? Five years old at this time. But how old are you now? I'm 21. Okay, yeah. All right, okay, so it's a five-year-old at this time, and I... I uh, damn, iPod Nano's been around for a minute, for a yo. Minute, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, anyways, so... Or it was one of those iPod Minis, whatever, right? Yeah, so with just the scroll, just yeah. the click thing. So right? it was a birthday present for my dad, and I guess I woke up in the middle of the night when he dropped it off, and I plugged the music in, and the first song I heard was Gin and Juice. Ooh. And he had NWA. He had all the classics on there. He had some of like, uh, like Earth, Wind, and Fire. Hey. Everything like, and I was Fire. just like, yo, I heard all these rappers, Dr. Dre, you know, Slim Thug, like hey. just like the OGs, everything, right? And I was like, yo, I want to do this shit. Like, hey. I really want to do this shit. And then. I, like I would just be straight listening to rap music like, all the time, like all the way up. Like I've, I've been riding the waves to a certain point. Like I can tell where the waves are going. Cause like, back in like 2012, it was like Kendrick Lamar style rap. Like he was blowing up. He had uh, swimming pools and all that, right? And then it moved on to the. Uh, right now, I feel like it went on to like the uh, Bobby Sh or no, at the same time Bobby Schmurder was out, like 2012, right? Yeah, like, like it was drill like, shit almost. Yeah, exactly, right? exactly. Yeah. And then it moved it's on. Like, wasn't he, I think it's like 2014. It's oh, 2014. Yeah, 2014. 2014. 20, yeah. And 20, uh, and then 2016 was like drill, yeah. like drill was the wave, and now we're. I don't know about that. Though. Nah, it was like more drill, 2014. Drill, drill, was, drill was 2012, yo. 2012, because, 2012. Because, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. because Chief Keef's album came out yeah. in like 2011. Yeah, I, I have I, that. I, everyone I, wanted yeah. that. That was the height of everyone was on that. That you know. With little right. mouse and all of those, yo, drill was popping back then. Oh yeah, yeah, sure. that's, that's what I meant. But like, that's what I meant. Everybody was like fucking hard with drill, and then the next year moved on to something else, and then now we're in this like, like, like Pop this rock, star, rocker, rock rocker, emo rap phase and shit. And I mean, like, I feel like like I, it's I, I it's cool and shit, but like at the same time, you gotta have like like. Lil Xan or whatever, right? He said he thought Tupac was boring. So you gotta have respect for the culture if you're gonna be doing the music, you know? You know what I mean, right? Yeah. But it's. Uh, it I, I do feel though that if you feel someone is, is boring, like, yeah, maybe yeah. don't say it in a disrespectful way, which I don't know if he did or not, but like, yeah. 
I think the thing, the problem was he gave it was they asked him to rate Tupac's music, and I think he gave it like a two. And then they're like, oh, wow. And he's like, oh, it's boring or something like that. Yeah. I think. I, you know, I don't know. I, I think everyone's entitled to their own opinion, but. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, Honestly, I like what OBI said because he said he's a musician, you know what I mean? And a music artist. And a lot, like, there's so many different, like, styles of rap and hip hop now, man. It's like, you know what I mean? You're yeah, exactly. Musicians, like, you okay, know? so if you were, for those who haven't. Uh, I guess you wouldn't be able to classify. You, you're saying you got many, many styles. You don't really got like, you know what well, I mean? I, I like because if someone, I'm saying like, if there was someone who had never heard the Young Roman before and yeah. you wanted to describe to them what Young Roman yeah, sounds like, like image, what is that? Like, right. Now, well, I went through transitions. Right? I've been rapping since I was 15. Back then, it was like when I was that age. Like Kendrick Lamar was my biggest influence, and I moved on, and I had other influences like, throughout the years. Right. And then for me, it was just like, yo, man, I'm so high. What was the question again? <laughs> <laughs> if you could describe your sound to someone who's never heard you before, I how would know. you describe your I, sound? I just, feel like, I just feel like, yo, it's like, it's just like, I, I can't describe it. I just like, for money, okay, when we, watch the, when we watch the money bag, I'm a block star, right? When you watch the money bags video, that's it's just like I can't describe okay, it. Okay, so what? Okay, then describe to us. Tell us a little bit about the money bags video, and uh, then we'll. All just right, how yeah, this yeah. came up? So we're uh, we're in G Town, anyways, and Two Tone calls me, and he goes, "Shout, shout out to Two Tone, big shout out." Shout out to Carlos. I love you. You're my blood. But like, anyways, we met up at the studio, and then I had this I had this hook down. It was should I invest in a stock or a Glock? Because people don't understand, like, Surrey, like, I feel like everyone's like, you're, you're trapped out there, you know what I mean? You don't know whether to go get an education or whether to go, like, hustle, you know what I mean? I feel like there's, like, the, you're, you're, like, trapped. So that's what I was trying with that, the line, the video there, right? That, that, that should I invest in a stock or a Glock? I'm good. Uh, that's, a, that's the line. So we recorded a song. I went in there, record, we recorded the song. Like right off the bat, pretty much freestyled the whole thing. Two Tone was like, "Yo, we gotta get this up real quick," and I was like, "Yeah, we should." It's like new way, yeah. And I was like, "Okay, let's do it," and that's pretty much it. I went from there. Shit, that's what's up. So shout out to Two Tone, shout out to Big Vita shout Creative, out. Big shout who, out. who shot it, and Two Tone obviously made the beat. Um, both who have been guests of the podcast, you know Making what it shit is. Happen. Okay, this is Money Bags, Young Roman. Let's check it out. Stay tuned. Money bags gonna be on a certain project. Money bags is a single for the Blockstar tape I'll be dropping. I was gonna initially drop it uh, June 10th, but I'm probably gonna delay it. In all honesty, I just wanna get the perfect sound for it. 
right? Yeah, and right. it's just I'm not doing like this. I also have a song on my SoundCloud called Full Pint. And it's not like I'm not doing this singing shit too. Like no. I got you on bars. That drill shit. Like, yeah, you on that. I got bars. Like yeah. and I I I go hard. So like just stay tuned. I'm going to drop another single next week. Next another week what one? day? I don't even know what day. Yet. Okay, so next week. possibly next by the time week. you're watching this, the single might be out already. Yeah, there you go, right? I'm going to remaster uh, Full Pint with my homie Young Knight. I'm going to put that on. That one was probably, it's the most liked, sound, like, liked song on my SoundCloud. And people went, man, you spouse on that. You spouse on that. And you, you know I got bars from being in the studio. Hey, you know, right. I mean, so, I mean, you you may or may not have a feature on my upcoming project, Long Live Low Key, Long September first. Yeah, yeah, you know, first, so you yeah. know, you know, hashtag, you know what I mean? Shit. Yeah. What's understood ain't even got to be explained. Of course, you got bars. I, I, I just got to yeah. tell, tell one time I got bars. That's all I got to say. Don't say. Don't, say. Don't, don't, say. don't think this is my first song. I got bars. That's all I'm gonna say. Yeah. He's period. got bars. Well, we're excited to hear that. The Block Stars tape. Stay tuned. Star. New single coming next week Block or possibly Star. already out. So go follow hey. Young Roman Six O Four. That's Young with a U, like Y U N G. So go follow him on Instagram. Click Squad. Do your thing. Click squad. Um, okay, we're gonna we're gonna, you know, we gonna keep it on moving to the next artist because yo, you you you've always heard about him. In we always cut. giving him a big shout out. Always around, always in the cut, behind doing the his scenes. thing behind the boards. But yo, he's behind got he's got a song it. out and I want him to Hello. come, you know. You know, can, can, can I tell him about yourself, Ace Boogie? Let, Let him know, know, man. Let him know. Low key general in the house, G Town. What's Ooh, good, man? Talk your shit. Hey, what's shit. up? Uh, Ace Boogie. If you already know. Ace Boogie 604 if you're trying to stream that shit, yeah. though. Spotify, Apple Music, go check it out. Tell hey, things, tune but. in. I don't know. No. I'm talking to the mic. <laughs> 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 it's working, though. Yeah. Hey, 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 hey. Test one, two, test one, test two. G-Town General. Hey. Hey, hey, hey. Okay, so yeah, tell them about what what, what what do you got on Spotify right now? What's, what's good? Right now, I dropped my first track. A track I worked on, like... Probably like last year or something like that, back when I was going through some things, you know? Mm. But it's called Plays. You know, it's my first track, All Me in the Track. You know, it's lit. It's <laughs> lit, it's lit. lit. It's lit. Fire. Check it out, you know? It's but lit. Are, you gonna, are you gonna be shooting a video for Plays? Yeah, some people, some people told me that I should, you know? Some I'm, I'm one of these people who's telling you yeah. you should. <laughs> I'm <laughs> you done. Should. Yeah. I wish yeah. you had plays yeah. here. For, I didn't even yeah, think about man, that. I wish you had plays hard. here to, to to let all y'all hear if, if you haven't heard. Have, have you guys all heard plays yet? Jmo, he's shaking his head. Obi, no. He show Cody <laughs> Van Gogh. No. Ro oh, Yo. the Reaper. Have you heard it? Plays. Okay, my hey, nigga. My Canadian nigga. underdogs. Have you heard it? Ah, oh, Safar. Have you heard plays? <laughs> Damn. And Neil. Damn. Hey, my nigga. <laughs> well, you know what? And if you're out home, at home shaking your head too, you know what you need to do is you need to go Click hit up a man's. Click squad. Ace Boogie 604. Ace Boogie 604 on, on that, but on Instagram, you know, hit him up and he'll, you know, get that, get that, go get that link and go, you know, go play it. It's, it's everywhere. It's streaming everywhere, everywhere, you know? Everywhere, except for SoundCloud. That's yeah, because... You know, need to gotta check. pay to play. You support know? your locals. <laughs> support your locals. It is what That's it all is. Gotta say. So, what can we expect from you to, to what's what's upcoming? Lots of things upcoming. I have a project with Big Puffer on the way. Hey, Loki hey, hustlers. You know what it is. Hustler. Loki yeah. hustlers. A couple tracks with G Kane. Hey. J Bone six four. Out. He about to drop his shit too. By the time you guys are watching this, it's probably gonna, it's be, gonna out. be out. Yeah. yeah so we'll check that shit out. I have some features on there. Same as Big Puffer. You know. But Ooh, no, no. a lot of things Street in the works right now. You know. Just stay tuned. That's stay it. tuned. Uh, Stay well, there you go. Fucking and with that, you know what? I think tuned. it's stay tuned, but I think it's time for <laughs> you already know what time it is. Hit it. Ooh. 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 Hey. Ooh. Hey. 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 Ooh. Video of the year. Ooh. Hey. No one still Ooh. no one's bothered. I see J Mo hey. there shaking his head. Here we go. Here we go. Get Here we go. Pew pop the studio. Hey, video of the year. Yes, Alright. Yes, 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 mm. Big shout All out. Right. To Scotty Jones and Bands for uh, ooh, winning last ooh, week's ooh, 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 ooh. video of the year. Big, big shout, shout out. out to Obi. Big shout out to Obi Reaper yeah. Films for, you know, 
the Shout video was so dope people. we had to play it again you know what i'm saying yes we did um this week we have uh a good a good one we have another good one it's uh dm and too tall got a song called hey, talking, that talking that shit and they're going up against ghost with a song called what if so we gonna we gonna start it off with that dm too tall talking that shit and remember if you if you want to vote go to my instagram and just vote on my story vote for which one you super think should easy. win super easy hit it Strap with the lyrics too You be so whack and the feelings do Talking that shit, talking that shit We don't fuck with you Ball on the track and I'm making the noise You be so whack and you making the noise Nah, bro, nah, bro We don't fuck with you Talking that shit, we not fucking with you Move like a bitch, I can see it in you All that you spit, yeah, that shit is untrue Not even this and I'm spitting the truth Fake nigga, fake nigga That's just what you do You been grinding for a minute You can't even buy some shoes Tu parles français Then femme ta putain So that's DM right. and Too Tall that talking that right. shit. If you think that video should move on for video of the year competition, go down and vote on the story right now on my Instagram, yo. Um, so I'm going to... Uh, what did y'all guys think about that that video? I want to hear some, you know? We'll start with you, Ace Boogie. What you guys think of that? What you think of that? I uh, fucks with that shit hard, yo. Yeah, right? That shit is lit. It's pretty lit. It's pretty lit. Yeah, yo, I fuck with that hard, heavy, yo. Shout out to Prince Too Tall. He gave me my first show, actually, yo. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Fan no, no, no. City, yo. Was, uh, so shout out to Prince Too Tall. That shit yeah. was hard, man. That's what's up. Yeah, that was lit. I enjoyed that. Yeah, that was <laughs> that's, that's what's up. Cody approved. It was good. It was good. It was good? Word. What, what about you, J-Mo? What are you thinking? Yeah, it was, it was fire. It was fire, <laughs> he says. Okay, that's what's up. What, what are you guys thinking over there? You like that? Yeah, you fuck with it hard. So sick. So sick. Okay, well, what about that's Big fire. Lock? But guess, oh, shit. what about Big Lock? What about Big Lock? What's up? What do you think Yo, about that? I thought that, that was Break stupid it? fire. Okay, okay. That's fire. Well, that's well, fire. there you go. But fire, it's it it's wasn't called just fire. It's stupid fire. Yeah. Okay, well, no. it's called Video of the Year competition for a reason, so yo. Now, yeah. It's not just one video. I don't even know who's next. 
Well, let me tell you. It's Ghost with the song What If. To this fire program, you would have never seen that video. Seen Woo. That. Yo, those are bars, yo. Bars. Damn. Okay, bars. okay. okay. Now you guys have seen both videos. What did you think of that last video? Actually, let, let me hear that. We'll start with Big Lock this time. You know what I mean? Can't leave you out. It's good, but he, he ain't beating my man two tone DM. Oh, so your that. vote's going to two? Okay, yeah, okay. In song, in song, in song and back. video, or or just. Honestly, bro, yeah, bro. Okay, Honestly, okay. Uh, J Mo, let, let me hear what J Mo got got to say back there. Oh, shit. What'd you think? What'd you think? Well, the video and the what you like, what'd you what'd you think of the last video? Oh yeah, it was the lyrics and the video too. Everything was good to go. It was really fire. Yeah? yeah, very fire. He says. What about you, Obi? It was pretty good. I enjoyed it. It was fire. That was fire. It's, I can't pick a favorite. <laughs> you can't. You can't. You're undecided, right? Yeah. Do I have to? Or <laughs> well, if you you don't have to, but it's encouraged. It. Yeah, yeah. It's encouraged. No, you don't. You don't have to on the air, but it's encouraged that you go to my Instagram uh, and vote. Okay. Yeah. You can go you, it, it's like, like voting. It's like voting for you. You know, you don't have yeah. to tell anyone who you vote for. Or man, true, Neil true. always likes to you know go back. Go and back look and watch over it. Again, it. You, you know, know, some people yeah. like to do that. That's fair enough. I'm probably gonna have to. Okay, yeah. there we go. It's understandable. What did you think about yeah. this last video? Uh, I mean, like the lyrics were there and everything, but I feel like that's the he kind of kind of reminded me like Mad Child. You know, it's got that old Vancouver sound. I just think we need to like get out of that, like the old Vancouver sound. Like I get it, it's like the old school style, but like 
Uh, like nobody's re- like man child. I don't know about that. Well, no, I think no, you, no, I think I think you better no, than no, man child. No, man child is just touring right now. I think no, you better no, than man no. child. Come I on, mean, man, give my homie a little bit of leeway. I mean, here. no, Come no, on. no. But when you when you Google uh, rappers from Vancouver. The Mad Child pops up, you know. The, he's like 50 now or whatever. Oh, I see. Is he got a tour right now? So. Yeah, I know. I know. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> but, 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 but I'm like saying, no, I don't think no, 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 no. Are similar, you know. I, I, not. I'm not saying the styles are similar. I'm just saying like the beat. The, like I don't know, man. I like 808s. Like I just. It's, so the lyrics were there. I get that, but it's just like it's an old Vancouver sound. Like it's. I feel it's, you. I, feel oh, you. I like. I'm I a, I oh you. yeah, you know what I mean. I, I already know what you're but gonna say. Don't you say. think you gotta pay respects? To who? The older, you know the. Older, oh no no, right? dog! I'm yeah, just I'm just I'm just saying. I feel no, like, geez. in my opinion, I feel like, Ghost is better than Mad Child. Oh no 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 no! I'm, I I don't I don't. I don't I, oh okay, yeah. I, I was like. No, no, yeah, I, I was just saying. No, I was just saying. You know, like that. Shit, you know, man, so. like, well, what what did you guys what did you guys think back? I was just talking of the video. I, I was just talking shit. Uh, just oh. Actually, you know what? I can't even ask the three of you back there because the three of these guys back here are all biased on one way or another. So Lil Reaper for sure, no matter what's gonna vote for the DM Too Tall one, and Safari and Canadian. Actually, I don't know what Safari's gonna vote for, but I know Canadian Underdogs is going with his boy Ghost. Yeah. Yeah, um, Safari. It was, it was. Two different styles, you know? It's two different Very. styles, you know? Hey. Two tall himself just King rolled in the house. Devil. What's good? Oh, hey. like stuff. Two talls in this motherfucker. Uh, you can't see, but we can. Yo. But yo. Fly. It doesn't even matter what we think. It matters what you think. So yeah, go vote. Does. Lord Geezy, go on my page, go on the story and vote. Is it two tall and DMs talking shit? Ooh. Or is it ghost? What if? You know what it is. All right, so uh, I want to give a big shout out and a thank you to everyone who uh, came to the Loki Operation show. Big shout out. Big shout outs. Thank, thank you. Thank you, everyone. That was our first. It was show, a, it was so. a dope. It was a do, it was a dope show. You know, it was. It was Jay Bones and Ace Boogie's first show. So we thank you. You know, that was dope. Oh, thank right. you for all those who turned out. Um. Yeah, well, you know what? I want to. I want to get into. Uh, I want to get some more into. You know what I mean? Uh, o- Obi. Obi had some. Uh, some. Exclusive. You know, we didn't get to talk about what you got coming next. So you know, I want. I want you to yeah, kind of give us a. Uh, you know, you're talking about this black and white. Yeah. 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 So why don't you go elaborate a little bit more about that? All right. Um. So. Black and white. The album. It's. Uh, like I said before, it's got two sides. It's it's the trap and, you know, the, Miscellane- the miscellaneous. miscellaneous. Yeah. Right? And uh, there's about, like, uh, 16 to 18 tracks on it. You know, I'm still, I'm still deciding. And um, it's almost ready. I already got, like, uh, 10 tracks ready. Okay. And I'm going to preview three tracks. Today, here exclusively we, here. Exclusive. Oh, low shit. Low key exclusive. Until I get the air horn, you know, I'm going to be making the sounds, you know? Yeah. Yo, fire. Yeah. Okay, so what? what's the first song we're going to start with? Um, Maybe tell us a little bit about that. The first song we should go, we should go, let's go Rockstar. Rockstar, okay. Rockstar. With Rockstar was trying something different. I'm that nigga with the 
You know, I know, I know, you know, they gotta know. Ain't nobody do it like me. So yeah, you know that's that fire, <laughs> fire <laughs> alert. That's what that is. So <laughs> that's a, that's a little sum sum that got on my album, black and white. So that's uh, that's gonna be on the white side. You know that's that's you know like more hip hoppy and more new day hip hop with the auto tune. Yeah, you know, yeah. You were saucing that auto tune, exactly. brother. Exactly, and it's more of a more of a vibe. You know. Yeah. That's what's up. Okay, well that's Rockstar. It's gonna be on the black and white project. What do we got next? Uh let's go on me. And hold up shout out to uh Araz. Shout out to Araz. The, the Rockstar beat and also on me beat. You guys hey. are fucking dope for you. Shout out, there shout out. I woke up feeling like more Luther King. Fan City gotta have a new shit. New shit. My niggas pull up for the motherfucking wings. date for when uh, black uh, and white's coming out i'm thinking i'm thinking buddy uh let's say mid june or end june and mid to end of june yeah, okay end that's end when that real that hot coming. around there okay yeah. so so tell us a little bit about this last song here before we get into it so this is uh who made the beat this is the th- it was made by uh Poritsky, risky on the beat shout out shout out and um it's more of the trap that I was talking about. Okay, no, more of that other side. That, yeah, that other the side. side. Okay. Exactly. Okay. <laughs> Nigga. 
it's just me with the gang. Hit the hood, man, I should go bang. In the morning, I'm grinding. Y'all niggas still yawning. I'm rolling. I'm with the team, with the same. We we'll stay up till we hit the fan. We keep balling and stopping. Y'all niggas keep talking. We popping and we don't ever break the code. Counting money for one big dream. Got Martin Luther gold. Till the day I die, I still certify. I stay on the grind. Got my beer, was right. One big dream ain't fucking with my life. One big dream ain't fucking with my size. Swish. The crowd go out tonight. Rick James, bitch. Whoa. Yeah, with the game, bitch, I'm certified Saying you just insane, I'm the same man. Fifth the gold chains, make this bitch win, bust back. You ain't Bruce Wayne, fall back. You lost your brain, you don't know pain till I come in. I just lay back, then your bitch can't. I'm always standing the silence, nigga, like Panda. I got two callers, you don't want problems, nigga. My bitch, just like Rana. Shoot up your ass in your Honda. Open up on the niggas don't wanna. Some of the syndrome, your niggas are fall. Just niggas keep looking to house for the culture. I give them hit like the mouth of my pistol. Society, they look to me to give them what they wanna see. The problem is, I gotta be just who the fuck I wanna be. So Without a corner, they keep debating ahead and surround them Cause I'm a hit, all these niggas won't answer My fucking bitch, you say I'm a handsome Yeah, with the game, bitch, I'm certified Rolling with the game, we're certified Fuck the ups, bitch, I'm certified You ain't with the gang, you ain't certified Yeah, with the game, bitch, I'm certified Yo, we back, we back, we back, we back. Yeah, yeah, straight, Certified, straight up, straight yo. Up, straight up, black up, and white up. coming mid coming to soon. end of June. Me too, end of June. So I need to stay tuned, and I need the Click Squad to go, mm-hmm. go, go follow my man's up. here on follow Twitter. Me. Go follow. Do you, I mean, Twitter, yeah. Instagram. Do you got Twitter? Instagram. Yeah, I got Twitter too, man. Do you yeah. use Twitter a lot? Well, yeah. Yeah, I do. Yeah. I do. Yeah. Okay. Well. I've seen a lot of this. What's, uh, what's your Twitter? You gotta keep up to Kanye and Donald Trump. You know. <laughs> that's that's. that's the, you know, I don't. I don't. The, <laughs> I don't. Nah, come on, man. It, it's good comedy sometimes. Sometimes it's entertainment. You see Donald Trump. It was it was funny at first, but shit he says. It was funny at first, but it's like, like eh. you just remember that he is still the president of the United States, and you just remember you can achieve anything and. You know, in life, I <laughs> guess, but if that we, we ain't gonna get too too <laughs> political <laughs> up here. Like nah, nah, we ain't gonna, we ain't gonna, we ain't gonna get too political e up in here. Vince McMahon's ass, and he's the he's the president. Hey, hey anything man. is possible, but you know what I, mean? I, I, I didn't need possible. him to become president to know that. You know what I'm saying? I knew anything was possible already. <laughs> anything but is possible. You know possible. what I mean, man. You know what I mean. I know yeah, what you bro. mean. I just yeah, fuck yeah. with you. But yeah, yo, uh, thank you again for sharing these exclusives thank with respect, us. You know what I mean? Respect. That's that's mad yeah, love, mad respect. Key exclusives. Low key exclusives, of course. Um, but now we. I don't know. We're gonna have to make this like a regular segment or something. For real? Oh, shit. I might have to make I might have to make a whole new graphic and a whole new song to go with it. You know, the we'll, do, we'll do it up. We'll do it up. Whole other segment of just straight freestyling. Freestyles, yo. We could have other people come and freestyle too. We could have like ciphers and stuff. It would no, be awesome. That's be fire. You yeah. heard it here. That's what's up. Okay, so why don't we? Put on to you know Safar. Let them see what's going on. What's going on? We're back at it. We were here last week. We had an amazing time. Like time. really looking forward to again being back here, spreading the awesome vibes. Everybody here is just like really chill and fucking awesome to hang with. Hey. So you know so we love it. You. We're enjoying it. Straight up. Okay, yo. Yeah. So let's just uh, get into this beat and let the homie do his thing. Hey, yeah, hey, yeah. Hey. Yeah. yeah. Can we turn the beat a bit up? So I could hear that, kind of could hear that reappear back. I love to crush the rhythm, uh, all this liquor that I'm chugging, sipping, fucking women. What I gotta say is daily when I'm hitting on the hazy, you know that shady he made me in grade three. It had happened back and forth. Now I keep on stabbing at these people like it's a matador. Rapping it, it be dope, it be tipping right off of the tip of the head. I be filling up another gat, you know that I be drilling you back when I be there making you so drill with the lead, killing you dead. Putting up onto the pavement, you know what I'm making? It's coming straight from the brain. I did not even go right it when I'm winning the bread. Yeah. 
Left to come and get it now. Uh, I'm a spiller with that bad style. If you clap it though, so professional. Still, I could barely hear the beat, but I'ma come in the tear from the dome. Tearing from the dome, it's amazing. I'ma come and then hit, hit another split, I blaze it. All the time you see that, every position is shaking. I'ma come and then infiltrate. In your head, I invigorate. If you wanna come fuck around, I'ma come cut you down, cause I intimidate. Yeah, I liquidate another rapper like it's wholesale. You looking at me, you can spit up a free, you know that you be looking like so stale. Mo pale, I go sip. Chilling up into the showbiz. Faux chicks, they wanna come and then roll with me and maybe smoke splits. Love to come and then do this i'm spitting it with my music you be looking at me i be the damn teacher you be that student and you learn it you observing the way i grab the damn beat and into the middle of the whole cypher session in the middle of a second i'm burning oh yeah you know that i'm earning some more paper with dope flavor like to come and then roll back and i need no motherfucking paper because you done hooked it up with that red stuff hooked it up with that red cup you know that this is coming right from the head that bread up i'ma go win it in the back pocket when i rap son it's never lack chronic i be blowing it up up like a damn comet you could spit it but you damn toxic all those people gossip they say shit they say the kv can't even go in make another free crazy is what i say in my spaceship holy fuck going higher all the time you see that i'ma come flow a bunch of damn lines bow i storm the beach like it's norman d 1944 you see eisenhower yeah all right, all right. You know what? Uh, no. we, we, we could, that was fire. That, that was, was fire. But we could hardly hear the we could hardly hear the beat. Hardly hear the beat. It was really hard. hard. I was can trying you, to do my best. Can you, know? can you do? Can you do so an acapella? Um, because beat. because I feel like you know what I mean. That that was that was fire, yo. You was just you was just yeah. killing it. The beat was too scared to go. <laughs> to go yeah, you know the bro. beat. I could do an acapella. Oh, shit. The beat, the beat was just like I couldn't hear it a whole lot, but um, I'll do an acapella as well. No problem. You know problem. what I mean? Just bless us with some some some, some, some freestyle bars. Free you know freestyle. Bars. But yo, that was fire. That was that fire. Was but it was like I knew fire. you couldn't hear it, so I'm like, fuck. I wish you could, you know, could hear it louder. You just. He still killed it. Still killed it though. He still killed it. He's probably why it didn't get louder. Yeah, for sure, for sure. All right, we'll do an acapella. I'm thinking. Um, all right. So, I like to travel, but traveling is a. Uh, hold on. I like to travel, but traveling is a handful. Especially when you're hungover and lacking any Advil. The hassle, it strangles and rattles me up with the shit. I'm gonna get drunk when I land and I'll be done with the shit. Hopefully hey. use my skills of Mackin to be fucking a chicken. If I don't, then fuck it. Still, I'll be having the fun in this bitch. And if it's Ooh. not fun, then you know all the rum that I sip is enough to temporarily leave me numb in this bliss. So let's go. Ho. Let's hey. go. Shorty looking fine from a head to a toe. Oh. She be looking sexy, but she doesn't even know. No. Am I gonna roll over and say hi? Like, Babe, you looking fine, wanna come over to mine and drink wine, blaze lie, you can stay high, maybe taste my D. You know I never put the pressure on, I just spit a song and then she's blowing like the Pentagon. Got gold Ooh. like I'm a leprechaun with lyrics I'm inventing, it's the way I get relief when my spirit it be stressing, plus the spirits they be helping, I'm Ooh. delirious as I'm melting. Ooh. When you hear this all your fear it disappears and it is ending, cause what I'm bringing it be like a narcotic, you don't even need to, you don't even need no weed, listen to Safar sonnets with the rhythm in the beat, it's like you dig a spark chronic, you can feel the freaking heat like I'm a Superstar Comet. Does it look like I'll stop this? Probably not. I'll only stop this once I'm left inside of a coffin to raw. But from now, I'm continuing to be making the hits that in your brain the shit it sticks is I'd be coughing from pot. Don't follow the law. Don't like being told what to do. I'm only 24, but my wisdom may be older than you. Age is really just a number. It's about your life experience. I've experienced more than you have, and you know that it's true because I'm a multicultural individual spilling syllables. Observe the way that I deliver them quick. I have a Canadian Polish Persian passport. Yeah, I'm the asshole who illegally has himself a triple citizenship it's hella legit internationally they call me a fugitive fucks given none get the blunt to abuse the shit i find it funny that the money that i'm finally making is a result of all these rhymes that are lucrative we got a round of applause in here open thank you thank you thank you now i remember last week we were talking before we get you out of here yeah and you were saying that you had a video yeah I do, I do have a video it's dropping i'm dropping it either tonight or tomorrow that's so like the by deadline. the time you the time, see this by the time you see this the video, the video will, will drop. be dropped so you have to watch my it. word is on this i'm saying it live so i can't fall you, back on this you heard him you heard you heard, it. You heard it it wasn't it me who said it what's was happening him. so he by the time you hear this this when man with the the, the the amazing bars Go is going to have his video. video out. What's it going to yeah. be called? Uh, the video is going to be called Hassles. Hassles? Hassles, yeah. So okay. Go hassles. run hassles. that shit up. up. Yeah. Quite. Okay. Filmed by my homie um, James Manzano. Shout out. Yeah, so Manzano filmed Ghost's video. 
That's what's hey. up. Okay, that's yeah. what's up. Yeah. Yo, yeah. Shout out to him. Shout out to him. Big shout out. Um. Okay. Well, yo. I want to give a big thanks to everybody who 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 came out today. Yeah, everyone who came in, you know, because a lot Thank of you, you came everyone. in like a record, you this know. Most people we had in the studio. We have both couches full. Straight up, both oh, couches oh, full. Got people shit. up and lean up against the wall <laughs> yeah, and they stuff. Did all this you know, shit. big shout out again to Pot TV, for Cannabis real, Culture. Real. You know, Always. long live low Hold key. Yo, look out for that. Uh, I need a click squad to do, do the thing. Everybody who's here, go follow them. Go check their music follow out. Shit, you know, man. stay tuned for the white, black and white album. Black and white. Black and white album coming mid to late June. Mm. Look mm. out for Safar's mm. video. Yeah, yeah, video coming before next week. Definitely so check before out. next week. So much yeah. Rolling with Cody Van Gogh or Nude Blunt. You know, oh. go check him out and see some of his dope creations. You know what I mean? Reaper yeah. Films, Canadian Underdogs. Check them out. Young Roman, Ace Boogie, got plays out right now. Money Bags doing numbers. We got Too Tall in the building, you know what I mean? Shout out to Anil. Shout out to my boy Mustafa. You know, he couldn't be here today, but Always he tried. Holding it down. Uh, shout out to the whole low-key crew, J-Bones, G-Kane, you know, everybody, you know what I mean? Shout out House Records. Shout out Big House shout Records, out. you know what I mean? Long live low-key, and uh, yeah, we out like that. You know what it do. Black royalty. Oh yeah, I be on clown.